Improving your PC's download speed reduces wait times for large files, better streaming and browsing, improved productivity, and optimized network usage. Here is a simple step-by-step -step guide on how to increase download speed on PC. Enable parallel downloading. Parallel downloading is a hidden experimental feature in Chromium-based browsers like Google Chrome and Microsoft Edge that accelerates downloads by splitting large files into multiple parts and downloading them simultaneously. This significant improves download speed especially for large files open edge flags page or chrome's flags page in the address bar type edge flags for microsoft edge or chrome flags from google chrome press enter to access the hidden experimental features menu search for parallel downloading you should see a setting named Enable Parallel Downloading highlighted. To enable parallel downloading, click the drop down menu next to Enable Parallel Downloading. Select Enabled from the list. Now restart Microsoft Edge or Google Chrome. Click the Restart button at the bottom of the page. Edge or Google Chrome will restart and parallel downloading will be activated. To check if it's working, try downloading a large file which is 500 megabytes or greater. You can visually observe parallel downloading by monitoring your network activity in Tax Manager. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus Escape to open Tax Manager. Go to the Performance tab. Click on Performance. Select Wi-Fi if on wireless or Ethernet if you're using a wired connection. Now monitor network activity at the send and receive speeds in real time. If parallel downloading is working, you should see a higher and more stable speed when downloading a large file. The download might start slow but gradually speed up. You may notice a speed boost compared to before. Now it's time to adjust Windows network settings. Press Windows plus R to open the RAM dialog box. Type CMD and press Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter to open command prompt as an administrator. Let's check the current auto-tuning status. Type NESH, which stands for Network Shell, a command line utility for managing network settings. INT is a short form for interface, indicating network-related configurations. TCP specifies transmission control protocol settings. Show global. This will display the current TCP settings, including Receive Window Auto Tuning Level. Take note of the Received Window Auto Tuning Level. If disabled, set Network to High Performance. Type NESH INT TCP Set Global, which modifies global TCP parameters. Auto Tuning Level Normal, which enables Receive Window Auto Tuning at the normal level, allowing Windows to optimize TCP Receive Window Size dynamically. This command adjusts Windows TCP Auto Tuning feature, which optimizes network performance by dynamically adjusting the size of the Receive window. Now let's change DNS settings. Changing your domain name system settings to a faster provider like Google DNS or Cloudflare DNS can improve your browsing speed, enhance security, and reduce latency. Open network settings. Press Windows plus R to open the RAM dialog box. Type ncpa.cpl and press enter. This will open the network connections window. Now select your network adapter. Identify your active internet connection. If you are using a Wi-Fi, right-click on Wi-Fi adapter. If you are using Ethernet, which is a wired connection, right-click on Ethernet adapter. Click Properties from the Context menu and open the IPv4 settings. In the Wi-Fi or Ethernet Properties window, scroll down and find Internet Protocol version 4. Select it and click Properties. Now enter faster DNS servers. In the Internet Protocol version 4 properties window, select use the following DNS server addresses. Enter the preferred DNS addresses. If you prefer Google DNS, type 8888 for the preferred DNS server. And for the alternate DNS server, type 8844. For Cloudflare DNS, type 1111 preferred DNS and 1001 for alternate DNS server. Click OK to save changes. Changing DNS to Google or Cloudflare DNS ensures faster page downloading, protects you against phishing and DNS attacks, and also provides a more reliable stability than your internet service provider's default DNS. To apply the new DNS settings faster, flash the DNS cache. Type the following command and press enter. IP configuration flash DNS.
you should see a message saying successfully flashed the DNS resolver cache. Now restart your internet connection. Disconnect and reconnect your Wi-Fi or Ethernet. To verify that your DNS is active, type nslookupgoogle.com. The DNS server displayed should now show Google, which is 8888, or Cloudflare, which is 1111. 